Alright, what is up you beautiful people and welcome back to the juiced up brawl. We are playing some Manx here today. Let's get right to it. So brawl modifiers, uh, whew, have we got a brawl modifier today. We got the Tychus Homebrew which is going to give us a huge amount of stim. We have Hallowed Ground here. Oh man, putting down lings with the uh, ergonomic mouse is definitely not the best thing but uh so uh hallowed ground here just gives it buffs here so this buff makes my lings a little thicker and we also have aura which hopefully if i pick it will give me either life or ooh, that's not great okay i can go for shadow shadow's good shadow's good so shadow gives me attack speed so yeah this week is just lots and lots of buffs we're facing off against uh i believe it's i believe it's crusader over here and then it's bob's guns over here um so that will be nice and spicy so let's just do that um, you probably should get some boys. Hmm. We'll get like a handful of boys. By a handful, I mean we're gonna have three boys and a lot, a large amount of limbs. Let's do it. Uh, but anyways, I'm gonna try and tech up to uh, get some, get some uh, shock divisions because those will be ideal. Uh, one thing I don't like. Oh my god, the Zerglings are just running circles around Alarak here. <laughs> They're running circles. Alright, there we go. So Bob's Guns is playing some Alarak. That's going to be pretty spicy, actually. Oh, but the Centurion's actually... Centurion's actually doing pretty good here. we got a lot of Marines here. I think these are Umojin Marines. Oh, yeah. Get them, boys. Get them, boys. Oh, Crusader's playing some Manx. Yeah, those Marines are toast. Those Marines are toast. Um, Here, I'm going to see if I can put down some more boys. Slap some LMGs on them. There we go. Actually, those, did those Marines survive? Those Marines actually survived. Alright, well, Bob's Guns here is probably just going to try and rush Wrathwalkers or, or Vanguards or something like that. I don't know. Uh, we'll have to see here. But, uh, yeah, let's do it. I don't know. This week is just like, I think Pure Aggro is pretty, pretty, it's going to be rewarded pretty handsomely here. However, uh, if Alarak has the knockback wave, we're going to be in a bit of trouble. There we go. There we go. We lost one of our boys there, but that's okay. LMG boys should be able to cut through these Centurions, maybe, maybe, maybe. Centurions have so much health. Holy, oh, LMG boys are just getting stunned here. And that's the end of them. That's the end of them. Um, okay, so I can't put my bunker anywhere else. I'll put it back here. This is going to be my Rocket Boy bunker. It's basically just our anti-air our anti -air option here. There we go. There we go. There we go. Aegis Guard here just going to melt through those Marines. Upgrade yep, complete. and Santa Chance, <laughs> and Santa Chance. Upgrade okay, we got some Ravagers coming on here. We got Upgrade Yeetus. Complete. Oh man, Abathur's so weak against these guys here. What's the go plan? Mutalisk. There we go versus Alarak. Uh, I don't know. Let's see. Oh, we got some Vanguards coming out here. Oh, okay, there's the knockback wave. Vanguards are gonna be hugely problematic here. There we go, LMG boys should clean clean house here pretty nicely. There we go. And by the way, guys, if you guys uh, do not know yet, we have our 2,100 subscriber live stream special happening, uh, well, this Saturday. So if you're watching this on Friday, then it's happening tomorrow. Uh, oh my god, that Oracle just putting out so many things here. Okay, there we go. Uh, I'm going to put down my first shock division. It's going to have so much attack speed. I'm just got to make sure it stays alive. Um... Uh, Oh yeah. Oh, he's got some Marauders here. Marauders are barely surviving. I think some medics would be helpful. But yeah, uh, tune on in. It's going to happen at 2 p.m. Eastern Standard Time until, um, what is it, 5 p.m. Eastern Standard Time? So yeah, come and check it out if you guys uh, can make it. And yeah, we can play a few rounds. And you know, the usual. The standard. Uh, 2 to 5. EST, baby. So let's see. The Mutalists here are just going to shred here. Yeah, so Bob's Guns is going to get Smacked by some mutalisk by the looks of it. Okay, we got some we got a we got a dark archon here I'm gonna probably need some detection here just in case. Oh, he sucked in. Oh look at all those lings just spinning on the outside That's hilarious. Oh Man, how fast is my shock division attack? Oh my god. It's acting like once every second. That's some beautiful DPS here. Come on Come on boys once every second boys. Let's smash it. Uh oh He's gonna die now one, two, three, four. Oh, if only I could keep it alive for long enough, then Rainer's Wave would be uh, going to have some more fun. Actually, but Rainer's Marauders and Marines are doing quite a good job here. 
I think they might be able to just smash this. Yep, there it is. Oh, we got some Ascendants coming out here. Ascendants can definitely drop a hard counter um, on our uh, Mutalisk here because the Ascendants drop a lot of AoE. There's only three Mutalisk too, so that's going to be kind of spicy. Do Ascendants attack air units? Uh, they don't, but they have Mind Blast, so they might as well attack air units with that. Uh, level up some, uh, some damage here. I'm going to need more Lings. I'm gonna need more tanks, I'll be honest. Let's see. When it sieges up, how fast does it shoot? Oh my god, it actually shoots once per second. There we go. Boom. 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 Got some Banshees here. There we go. There we go. What's up? Ascendants also don't have much range. I think you could just go, uh, what is it? Guardians. Uh. Could also try Guardians Lol. I don't know. Guardians with the extra attack speed uh, are not bad. Uh, not let's see. Minerals. Boom. Where's my X? There we go. Getting our shock division here. There we go. Like boom, 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 not boom, enough boom, 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 Let's put them. There we go. Let's put them all down. Yeah, but the reason I'm suggesting Guardians is because Guardians have extra range. So it's like it doesn't really matter about the extra damage against armor. Guardians just don't get close enough to the Ascendants. Uh, and they can also contest Wrath Blockers decently. Uh, so there's also that. There we go. Okay, the Shock Division should hopefully just smash through these Archons. Yep, there they are. They're smashing. They're smashing. They're smashing. Let me smash. Let me smash. Rainer Bio here. I mean, I got some shock divisions in the back to back up my Rainer Bio, so Rainer's not getting any tanks. I got him covered on that section here. Oh baby, it's time to smash. I mean, if I can, if I can push into Bob's Guns' wave here, we can just sort of smash our way through. Uh oh. I mean, I don't know. It's good enough. Uh, I could probably get some Ultralisk actually. I don't know. I'll probably just have some flame boys actually on this side. I don't know how valuable that's gonna be, but uh, so strap them up with some flamethrowers. That's gonna cost a lot of money, and I'm gonna I'm gonna tech up here. There we go. There we go. Some flamethrowers would be able to counter these centurions pretty nicely here. Um, there we go. There we go. There we go. Uh, actually, I don't know. Maybe I should get some. More lanes and stuff. Boom, 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 boom. Uh oh, shock division. Uh oh, shock division. Overrun, overrun. But Rainer Bio here is just gonna just gonna keep going. Rainer Bio is just gonna keep on trucking. Rainer Bio does so much damage this week because like he already has stim, and then like you put the stim on the stim, and now you're just stimming. Uh, ooh, those ascendants are just gonna murder those units here. Holy! I wonder if uh, Bob's Gun's got storm or something, some sort of energy regen that could warrant. Uh, that many ascendants, uh, but yeah, all those mutals are just gonna get mauled. Um, I mean, I guess a mend could work. Why are they going backwards? Oh, they're going backwards because there's nothing to hit. Uh, okay, there we go. That makes sense. Uh, we got some flame boys here. Get some roasties. Um, pretty sure we'll be fine here. I'm gonna need a black hammer to deal with these corsairs. They're uh, somewhat annoying. Uh, we have a stolen mutalisk here. Just going ham. I've got a stolen shock division here. That's gonna level our opponent, like our way. But now the shock division has been kept safe and s kept safe for later. And now it's on our side. Back again. There we go. Glorious. That's why you don't steal stuff that you can't kill. You know, if you can't kill it and you steal it, you're gonna in for you be in for a bad time. That's a lot of ascendants, by the way. Holy! And there's no chicken nuggets either. It's literally just pure ascendance. Woo! But this one shock division here. Oh, someone just subscribed. Hello. Uh, but yeah, this this shock division is just gonna go to town. Uh, but the mutalists are getting confused, and the corsairs are gonna knock them out here. Uh, the best way to counter all those all those war zoom dudes is, I think, is just to get some boys. Wait, what the heck? Did that centurion just go fly around in a circle? Man, Stim is like Stim is making them hit different boys. Stim be making uh, all our units hit different. There we go. We got that one Corsair versus all those Mutalisk here. Who would win? 
that one mutilisk skip apparently. Oh no, actually there's another Corsair here. Okay, never mind. I was like, who would win? <laughs> that mutilisk looked like it was gonna go to town here. Uh, there we go. I'm gonna get some more shock divisions here. The shock divisions are really anchoring us down. But I will also want some Ultralisk. Um, oh my god, the Ascendants are just murdering the Rainer Bio. You know what will kill the Ascendants? An Earth Splitter. I need to get one of those actually before I get the Ultralisk. Uh, actually, I don't know. If the Ascendants don't have their shields up, then yeah, they'll, they'll get murdered. But if they do have their shields up, they'll survive. Uh, but oh my god, the Muta bounces actually. Ooh, but then the Mutas just get confused. And then Savorzun just goes to town on them. Uh, there we go. Earth Splitter is also going to gain Stim, by the way, and since I searched, I have the attack speed aura, Earth Splitter is going to be attacking at like a meteoric pace. Um, so yeah, I'm going to get Hemispheric Accelerants, I'm going to get one level of this. Um, there we go. I don't even know, boys. Oh no, he unsliced my bread! Those silly Corsairs! Oh man, they're unslicing my bread. There we go. Boom, 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 boom. Okay, we got Garrison level 2. You can get some Emperor Shadows here to deal with the Archons. That'll probably be useful. Uh, so this is attacking every 6 seconds. Um, that's pretty good. That's going to hit all the Chicken Nuggets, I think. No? Okay, yeah, they hit the Chicken Nuggets. Uh, okay. You know what? Yeah, I'll get some Emperor Shadows. We'll see. Because they'll be good against all the energy and all the casters and stuff. Oh, man. Oh, man. The Orb of Doom. All of those Mutalists just got destroyed. You can't spread out your mutas because you know what? The thing that mutas do is they clump. You know, no matter how well you spread them out, they're gonna clump together, boys. And there's no, there's no way you can, there's no way you can spread them, boys. You know, you can't spread them. There's only so much you can spread them. You know. Um, let's see. And I'm gonna push this back here because I feel like we're gonna lose that. We're gonna lose that there. There we go. That's going down. I'm gonna enter shadow probably over here. There we go. So she should be able to uh, do some damage. Let's see. It drains the EMP and also deals damage, so it's going to be pretty good here. <laughs> there we go. Alright. That's as good of a spread as you can get, but you know, it's not going to get any more spread. Uh, there we go. Boom. I'm going to try and level up my garrison, actually, so that it just goes to max rank. I don't even care right now. Um, okay, so this is like a 5 second, that's just better than 5 seconds, it's like a 4 second barrage here. Every 4 seconds does 100 damage. Come on boys, let's get in there. Okay, well all the Ascendants are dead, the Black Hole's there, but is it really going to do anything? Oh, it might. It might actually. There we go. My, my Rocket Boy battery here. I'm going to level it up. Okay, come on Rocket Boys, kill it off, kill it off. I'm going to have to move my Rocket Boy bunker back. I value the Rocket Boy Bunker over like the other ones anyways, so it's like... Oh! They stole all my Shock Divisions, but now they're still alive. Nice. There we go. Um, Yeah, those Shock Divisions are going to be able to anchor the base in here. I'm going to put Garrison up to max rank here. Let's see how fast it shoots. It shoots every three seconds? I'll take that, boys. I'll take a three second uh, blast from the Earth Splitter here. Um, we got a Men coming out here. Okay, so that Muta spread was actually pretty good. Uh, so now the next thing I need to do is make sure I just get some Ultralisk, because I need to really counter these, uh, these this mind control. I don't know, the DTs will sort of mess me up though. Um, let's see, I probably need more Emperor Shadows to be honest. Oh, she got mind controlled. Unfortunate. Uh, but the Earth Splitter is just going to do lots of damage here, just non-negotiable damage. Um, there we go. She's getting DPS down. Oh, uh oh, shock divisions. They got stunned. Uh, okay, so I'm gonna get some ultras here. Let's go for it. Let's go for it. I don't know. I, I'm, I'm, I'm just choosing to believe in the power of uh, the Earth Splitter as well, because the Earth Splitter just uh, hopefully can. I don't know. It shoots really fast. It's basically just like another siege tank at this point. It's gonna land like right there. Ooh! We're gonna take off all the shields on those units here. There we go. Uh, it's gonna make the chicken nuggets more vulnerable. Ooh, look at all those blasts! Oh, but those mutals actually. The mutal spread actually did help out. There we go. There we go. It actually did help. Um, but now it's like super clump now. So there's that. Um, there we go. Let's get some. 
get some higher armor upgrade here. There we go. We got a Void Ray. Nothing our LMG boys can't handle, I think. Uh, there we go. There we go. I'm just going to need some more Ultralisk here. Um, but I think we'll probably go for another gas now because I don't think I don't think we're gonna be able to push in too hard here. I need more Royal Guards actually. Um, I have a lot of EXP that is not being spent. Uh, could probably buy an Aegis Guard. I don't know, but I do want to get more Shock Divisions. Shock Divisions are doing good. They're doing a good job here. Oh man, those tanks are just getting mind blasted. Woo! Their puny brains are exploding from the power of. Uh... <laughs> The, uh, the big Protoss brain. The Giga brain. There we go. Oh my god. Boom. Wait. As long as there's targets, it's basically just going to land a shot as soon as there's another shot. Holy. Look at the fire rate on that Earth Splitter. Rapid fire Earth Splitter. Ooh. Uh, unfortunately, Earth Splitter is not great at tracking its targets. Uh, but, you know, we don't, we don't have to worry about that later. Um. There we go. We have some mind-controlled Nudalisk, but now they're back and on our team. And the Corsairs are not going to be able to kill it, that's for sure. Uh, my front line actually just goes forward and dies too quickly, though. Mm. I don't know what to do about that. Maybe I'll build some Aegis Guard here, just to escort the tanks. I don't know. I'll just put, the, put down some Aegis Guards here, escort the tanks. Uh, I'm gonna need some more boys probably here, so let's just do that. Uh, uh, I mean, boys with stim is pretty good. Let's get that going. There we go. And yeah, I'm gonna hmm. let's get the incapacitator shells here. Oh my god, all those ascendants there. Yeah, I'm gonna probably get another emperor shadow maybe, just to get some more get some more spiciness here. We got another black hole coming out here. Yeah, I definitely need to deal with those uh, those. These Archons, so I'm probably going to need at least two or three more Emperor Shadows, and that hopefully will take care of business. Uh, especially because she's dropping the EMP Blast over here, and not on the Archons. Although I think the Ultralisk can deal with the Archons, as well as the Aegis Guard. Yeah. I just got to make sure I deal with these things. Uh, although Emperor Shadows are considered biological, so she'll be able to just stim, stim DPS her way through the Void Race, so I'll be fine. I'll be fine. Yeah, I'll be fine. Um... Uh, I'm probably, yeah, I'm gonna buy another Emperor Shadow though because I do want to try and space things out um, a little bit more. So there we go, one, two, three. I'll put her down over here. There we go. There we go. So it drains 100 shields and then depletes the energy. And I think the energy gets, yeah, energy gets dealt back as damage. I'd love that to hit the Archons because then the Archons just can't do anything. Although the mind control will still work, uh, they just can't use their confusion, I guess. Uh -huh. Let's drop a fat scan here, but all those Mutalists are just going to murder each other um, because that's how the Mutalist AoE works, you know. Haha! <laughs> just going to murder each other here, there we go. Made some more weapon damages here. Okay, there we go, there we go. Woo. Okay, two Emperor Shadows here are doing good work here, but uh, I'm going to need some more forward detection here because those Void Rays are getting past me. Um, so maybe I will I will summon another one of these, but this one is not going to siege up. This one will just follow my troops forward. What's the plan? Um, okay. I'm going to need more shock divisions, though. I only have three. Three is not enough. It's like a sin to only have three. Let's be honest. Oh, you know what I can get? I can make one of them fly. I can get some flying shock divisions. And maybe hopefully that'll that'll hit the void rays as well. Oh, yes, yes, yes. That'll be, that'll, that'll be ideal. Uh, but let me buy the shock division first. I don't want to. I don't want to spend on uh, intercessors just yet. I probably could buy some just to heal up Avatar's wave and also to heal up uh, Reina's wave because Reina has a lot of those things going on. Um, probably should have scanned there. I don't know. Uh, okay, those tanks are gone. Those mutalisks are gonna come back. There we go. There we go. Okay. How are my Emperor Shadows doing? Okay, so their cooldown reduction, they're just running out of energy though. Let's see. I should probably put them in the energy regen section, shouldn't I? Let's see. Yeah, okay, anyways, I'm gonna put down our tank here. I'm gonna level that tank up, and then I'm gonna grab a bunch of intercessors here. And by a bunch, I mean like two. Hopefully, I can get a few more, because then, like, I can mount one of my shock divisions on there. 
Uh, let's get the upgrade first. And then I'm going to pick you up. There we go. There we go. I'm going to have a flying tank here. Uh, this is 25% energy. This is just energy regen is on that side. Okay. So maybe I should put my... I should put my uh, Emperor Shadow here. I don't know. I'll just have all my Royal Guards bounce on one side. There we go. Because really, like, I don't think she's uh, too really gated by the cooldown. I think she's really much more gated by the uh, energy. There we go. We got our flying tank here. There we go. Flying tank. Come on, flying tank. Increase attack speed. Okay, flying tank gets dropped on the ground. Um, I need a black hammer. I need a black hammer. We're, we're gonna need. We're gonna need more than than what we have going on here. Uh, I'll probably put black hammer on the left side as well. Rainer has... Did Rainer just sell everything and turn it into tanks? Or did all the boys run forward and die? And now all we have left are tanks. Because Rainer tanks are just not going to hold up here. They don't have enough health. Or do enough damage. Like, Aegis Guard just cut right through them here. But I think I think I need, definitely need a Black Hammer right now. Uh, I feel like I could get an August Grab. And that, that might be super sketchy. In terms of... Uh, making it happen here. Oh man, the Ascendants with their Mind Blast coming in here. We got our boys. Okay, there we go. Where's our where's our Earth Splitter? Please land on the Ascendants. Oh yeah, the Earth Splitter landing on the Ascendants there. Oh man, got some tanks blowing up here. I have no more front line left though. Uh oh. Wait, huh? How did we not see that? Oh my God. Okay, well those tanks got stolen, which means they're gonna come back to us. Um, at some point. Okay, they're just going to constantly get stolen. There we go. Okay, so that tank's coming back to us. I need a Black Hammer here ASAP. Uh, there we go. Black Hammer. Retract that. Um, I want some Rocket Boys, I'll be honest. I don't know. Uh, come on. Turn those into Rocket Boys. There we go. There we go. Oh. My missile bunker here got taken out. Oops. That's unfortunate. Uh-oh. Earth Splitter's gonna go down here. Here we go. It's the moment of truth, baby. Um, Black Hammer. Hopefully gonna be able to hammer down. Put the hammer down, boys. Oh, no. I don't have what it takes. There's too many units on the ground. Unless... Oh! Damn. I think I need to get that black hammer a little earlier there. Um, yeah. Maybe this this flying tank was kind of a meme. I think if the flying tank, if I got it after I got the black hammer, that would have been ideal. But Earth Splitter was doing huge damage here. Holy! I was doing so much damage here. Uh, but how much stuff was I killing? Um, okay, I was killing most of it. I think Aberthur with the Mutalist was okay, but he really needed Guardians. I think Guardians would have been a good idea to switch into. Um... Because Mutalists eventually drop off simply because there's so much AoE. Like, Bob's Guns here, well, look at that. Got the Ascendant Army here. Corsairs do AoE, and they also confuse. I don't know, actually, hmm. What would Avatar have done against Warzone here? I don't know. It's like Leviathan. Levi oh, can Leviathans get mind controlled? I think they're heroic, right? But Leviathans are also super expensive, and they die. They die super hard to uh, Sky Furies. Yeah, I, I don't know. I don't, I don't think Avatar had any good options there. Um, maybe he could have just kept spamming Ravagers. Um, Ravager's Mutalist. Ravager's Mutalist. I think that might be a good combo. Just Ravager AoE. I don't know. We'll see. Well, if you guys enjoyed this game, be sure to leave a like. And until next time, I will see you guys later. Wait, let me check on the kills first. Well, that's pretty good. It's pretty good. All right. Well, then, I'll see you guys later. The tires. Let's light some fires. They picked the wrong fight.